Okay, I'm going to show you how to animate sprites and images in MIT App Inventor using the website piscalapp.com. Let's take a look. In order to animate a sprite or a background or other image on MIT App Inventor, we have to create individual frames and then time them through using the code that we create for App Inventor. I'm going to show you how to do this with uh, Piscal App, which is a free online site that allows us to create sprites and other things really easily. So I went to Piscal App, create sprite, and uh, I think we're going to make a Pac-Man character here. So I'm going to find a nice bright yellow color and make a circle. So make it nice and big to fill the screen because it it makes a better sprite, in my opinion, usually when I do that. Uh, and I'll go ahead and fill that with that. And I'll give him my Pac Man some dark eyes. Okay, so that's a weird eye, <laughs> but that are, that's all right. Um, so now let me just keep on animating uh, the rest of it. I'll make a couple of frames here so you can see it. And I'll just keep hitting the duplicate this frame and making the mouth bigger and bigger. All right, I'll do it one more time. Okay, so now we have a basic drawing, and you can see that it's animated over here. I'm going to go to export. I could also, it would be really wise to go to save and save it to my gallery. Maybe I'll give it a name like Pac-Man. And now I'm going to go to export. And I'm going to choose a zip, and I'm going to choose split fly layers, and then download. So you can see it's open there. Your computer's probably going to look different than mine. And now I can, can view it in the file. It can work kind of like this on yours as well. And when I look in there, I can see that my sprites are all there, and they're named in order. I'm going to do a little renaming here because I want them to have a really simple name. I'm going to name it 1, 2, oops, not 1, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And that's because when I use this on um, App Inventor, you know, it'll make sense. It'll be a lot easier for me. Okay, so now back to App Inventor. And I guess I'll just put an image on the screen. And I'm going to go to Files and Upload Files. Now upload those four images. Okay. So now I'm going to go to I'm going to add a sensor in here. So a clock. And this clock is going to allow me to animate the picture. So I want the picture, the clock interval to be pretty fast. I'm going to say 300 milliseconds. We can change that if it doesn't seem right. But to make it so every time the clock ticks, I change the picture. I'm going to use a global variable to keep track of that. And I'll name it bright timer. Okay. And now Every time the clock ticks, I'm going to set Sprite Timer to whatever it was, plus one. And so, if it gets beyond the number four though, that's a problem, so I need to keep track of that. So if the number gets to be four, um, 
actually, if the number's five, because four is the number of things we have. So I'm going to make this one more than the number of pictures, whatever that number is. So I'm going to say when that gets to the number five, I'm just going to set my count to be back to one again. So I'm just going to loop endlessly. All right, and now I'm going to set my image to be my image one picture to be. And so this is the reason why when I chose these names, I made them so simple. So I have 1.png, 2.png, 3, and so forth. So now I can go to this, and I'm going to do a join. And I'm just going to create this name. So the end is PNG, so dot PNG, and then I'm going to create that name. And so this is just going to cycle through it. Now it would be really clever if I made a count up and count down. That would be really good, but this will do it. Um, let's see if I so you can see that it actually works. Okay, so <laughs> here it is, animated to make a chopping face. Again, if I rewound it, if I counted up and then counted down, or if I drew more pictures so that they were going both directions, it would, it would animate better. And obviously, if I had more pictures, it would animate more smoothly. You can see it didn't take really that long.